coach kicked off summer in style with a bash held at the High Line. Katie Holmes was among the stars who enjoyed the carnival theme soiree, which featured a dunk tank and whack-a-mole. Coincidentally, both Holmes and Naomi Watts stepped out wearing Chloe dresses with, of course, coach clutches. Connie Britton, Zachary Quinto, and Olivia Thurlby were among the fashionable stars in attendance. Well, I'm really excited to be here, and I, I think it's so great that Coach is sponsoring this event that is, you know, all the proceeds are going to the maintenance of the High Line, and I'm such a huge fan of it, and it's such an important part of New York City. I've been a fan of the brand for many years. I'm very into their um, handbags, shoes, sunglasses. I got to come to this party last year with my brother, and we had such a great time. There's, like, carnival games, and it's such a beautiful park. It's so amazing. So I was obviously really happy to come back. Spotted elsewhere, Steven Tyler ran errands in the McGraw-Hill building, while Avril Lavigne stopped by live with Kelly and Michael, where host Kelly Ripa was seen shooting a cooking segment with her husband, Mark Consuelos. Also on the promotional circuit, Harry Connick Jr. paid a visit to The Late Show with David Letterman, Lawrence Fishburne filmed at Good Morning America, and Nick Lachey hyped up his latest album at Toys R Us. Across the pond, the Man of Steel cast brought their new Superman flick to Leicester Square. Amy Adams stunned in a dress by Valentino, while Henry Cavill looked dapper in a suit by Tom Ford. It's just nice to be here in the home nation after having worked so hard in the movie and put so much heart and soul into all of us. Be finally here and showing it to, you know, home. We shot it almost two years ago, so it's great to get to see sort of this response and have the excitement and, and hopefully the audiences. Uh, like the anticipation is, is worth all of the build up. That's the latest. Join us tomorrow for more celebrity sightings.